For many years, Moshe said, listen, we've got to find a name for this work. Did I tell you this story? No, I'm ready to hear it. Oh. And because he said, Feldenkrais is such a terrible word, nobody will ever say it. So we kept making words and words and words, and my father was a well-known linguist, and we all said the making names. Many years passed, and then we came to America, and the name remained Feldenkrais. And everybody says it today, right? <laughs> but uh, one day I said, Moshe, I found a name. Somebody found a name. And this is President Obama. When he said he swept the whole nation by saying, yes, I can. Our work is yes, I can. Because if this shoulder is so painful, Let's see, why is this yes I can and this no I can't? So let's study the yes I can. If he can turn his head that much, let's study why he can turn his head that much and hear only to hear. So let's start, we are studying the yes I can. If you go to give a eye to somebody, first you go to the place that is good. Oh, it's moving. Nice, and you say, look, this is a nice feeling. You don't go to, yes, I can't. You go to, yes, I can. And that's how you build an FI. You go from the, yes, I can, to a, yes, I can, to a, yes, I can, and you enlarge it. So this is our work. When, when we first started uh, working, we wrote one book. And I helped Moshe in it, and we wrote it. It was beautiful. And we had a little uh, wooden doll at the time. That's the nearest to a skeleton we could get. And we had it. Actually, this is the table we did it on. I brought it to America. Oh, wow. And we photographed <laughs> it on this. And we did the raise the arms. It, it was very nice. So when... Uh, when we, uh, we, we finished the book, we gave it the name in Hebrew, calling, if I translate it prop, uh, exactly the words, um, refinement of ability. For, like for instance, if you can move the arm or turn the head that much, if you refine it, you can turn it even more, yeah? So that's where the refinement comes from. So they translated it into English and they published it in America and they called it Awareness Through Movement. But uh, I think that the future of this thing is refining your ability. If you're a basketball player, you can refine the way you throw. It's a, it like puts it on the borderline of art. You refine art, you can, you can make a beautiful drawing of a flower, but uh, not like Van Gogh. So the refinement is what we're after now because we all know ATM and FI. Take the same ATM and FI, and there's also many kilometers to run. Mm -hmm.